Hello everyone and welcome to a new IK video. This is Ken and in this video we're gonna talk about uh, Front of the Supreme and how to prepare for your opponents if you 100% sure that they are AFK. So in my case here I had a fight against one of the biggest whales that are in server 56 which is Bunny that has paid us a visit from 56 to play KVK in our lines. So this is how the fight went. I know Bunny has been AFK for quite some time looking at the Alliance uh, tab here. I believe she's at R3. No, she's at R4. Ah, uh, this is R4. Right, so you can see that, that her status is present, which means I know 100% that she does not log in to check her lineups. She does not log in to use boosts so i made my presets and i prepared my presets in order to counter all her marches so how to do that you simply need to look at the history of the player so looking at this much history here that you can see that she's always using her holy march at the beginning uh, of the her formations she's using athena in lead this is gonna work in my favor i'm gonna explain why she's using poseidon with a life link this is a triggered skill so if it, it needs time to be activated and if the immortal was silenced the skill does not get activated and of course the rest of the uh, troops are known to everyone you can see that she's using the famous this is the the current meta for all the mega whales in the game however we're not able to detect the rest of her formations except this one here you can see she's using a mixed march and then she's using a shadow march we cannot see the last uh the last march she is using but then we go to the points race and then we can check the last march this is her holy and then she's using her mix and then the shadow and then the last march she is using she's using a lightning march with hammer happy and jinkies and Elsa. so how to prepare for this simply you need to know how to counter each and each and every march of hers so for my case here, I know that building the Mixed March that I talked about in one of my previous videos can counter this if she's not using any kind of boost. So I know Athena in the lead, so I'm going to use my Hannibal in the lead. I'm going to make sure that my Alexander faces her Poseidon and it's going to be easy for my Mixed March to clear as exactly predicted here. You can see in the first battle, I managed to beat her uh holy march the chaos holy march that she's using you can see all the skills that i've used is exactly as i explained in uh, my previous videos you can see i'm using no escape i'm using energy suppression i'm using the war placing and the speed placing i need just to make sure that poseidon dies as quickly as possible and you can see he only landed four normal attacks only four attempts from his normal attacks so i believe he died in less than maybe 12 seconds let's see right so we're gonna pause once he dies it only took alex eight seconds to kill poseidon and the rest of the fight should be easy should be cleared since this is just a turn of supreme troops usually doesn't have the same amount of sustain as in the usual fight Alright, so I know right now that the second march she is using is her mixed march. So I'm going to use my fire march in front of her mixed march. I'm going to make sure that my Trajan faces Alex with defensive skills. So let's see how did it go here. But I believe that my mixed march cleared both her chaos march with holy and then the mixed march. But then I suffered some losses here. And then my holy march with the wind <laughs> with the wind dragon my i'm not sure how to call this my wind holy chaos march went against her shadow march at least the remaining of the her shadow march and this is how it goes i never expected this march to perform this well to be honest but it did it was the same for my second battle against bunny i made sure that alex faces Poseidon, and then the same scenario happened my mix cleared the first march and then the second march and then my fire march cleared the rest of her marches i know i was using boost and she does not use this boost but then again it was nice 
to beat a mega whale that is using her own marches but then i had to drop the rest of the fight because aruha asked me to because our dictator already made the bets and i had to comply anyway this will be all for this one this is how i prepare for my turn of the supreme fights planning ahead of time in order to make sure that i counter the opponent marches so this will be all for this one thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel and have a wonderful day